gray hair. I tell you what, uh, hold on that way. Mike Ward had that thing, uh, had, the, had the trick set up on it, and uh, you were able to put that thing anywhere you wanted. Yes, it was, and I'm going to tell you what, I'm really glad to get this trophy. Um, you know, we all miss Jesse. He was a good guy, hard racer. And, I'm, I'm really glad to get this, and I hope it's not greedy, but I hope I get the one tomorrow night, too. Well, you're locked in for tomorrow night. Uh, the racetrack is slicked off, but uh, like we said, the, the, the setup of the car, I mean, spot on. You were able to run that thing right through the middle of the groove and uh, go anywhere you wanted. Tell me about that pass for the lead, though, uh, right around the top of the road. Well, you know, sometimes when you're leading a race, it kind of goes that way. When you're up there and you really don't, you know, you don't want to experiment. So whatever's feeling good, you just stick with it. And me, behind him, Jeff was challenging me some there before that one yellow, and I seen him coming in the middle. And the track kept getting blacker and blacker, and I thought, you know, I better start searching now because if I find it first, I can get there first. And uh, I know since you're a buddy of mine, you'll be glad to... Uh know that I'm eating crow because I did a talk show earlier this week and uh, I told everybody, man, I'd be real surprised for Crowley making a victory lane like he did last time because uh, hey there, he's a screw track specialist, but here you are, man. So go ahead and kick me. <laughs> Thanks, pal. <laughs> Yeah, we, we good buddies. How about this old cat behind you? He does so much for you, Mr. Mike Ward. Hold that uh, sign in there. Uh, he's brought a lot of success to you guys uh, in the race team here. Yeah, you know, him and Billy and everybody that's involved in, deal, in this deal works real hard on everything. And, you know, Mike's a perfectionist. He wants everything just perfect. So I do my best to do everything I can in the seat and point the steering wheel in the right direction. So it really makes it great and easy on me, though. It's a good feeling to have this old cat standing next to you, Papa Jack Hockett, and a uh, little hard where you're home. You bet it is. All right, man, thanks for your time. Good luck tomorrow night. And make me eat more crow. Yeah, I hope I do. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, give me a big round of applause. Come on, come on, come on. That's what they say.